Hey Word Nerds, it's Ink Slinging Monday, and today we're going to talk really quickly about maps again. So my most viewed video of all word nerd history is my map making tutorial where I talked about how to make maps on GIMP, which is kind of like a free version of Photoshop. If you want to check that out, you can go here. I'm pretty sure it opens in a new window, so you can open it and watch it later. And someone commented on that video, what are you doing, girl? Auto realm? Exclamation point, exclamation point, exclamation point works a lot better. And I did take a little bit to kind of bristle at it, kind of like, what? Who are you? Why are you calling me girl? But then I got over it and I went and I checked out Auto Realm. And I gotta say, I'm really impressed with the program. Auto Realm is made by people primarily who play like Dungeons and Dragons, where you want to make really elaborate maps for your role-playing games. But I've found that it works amazingly for creating worlds as well. Unlike in GIMP, where you use the cloud rendering to come up with an outline and then you make your map based off of that outline. In Auto Realm, you have the ability to actually draw out what you want your world to look like. And it has this option called fractal lines where it actually makes the lines look jagged and like a coast. Auto Realm also has a toolbar along the bottom that has tons of images that you can use for mountain ranges or castles or rivers, wastelands, swamps, deserts, you name it, they've got it. And they've got the big things like the terrain and they've also got much smaller things like if you want to map out a city or even a house they have it i've been having a lot of fun with it over the last few days so if you're at all interested in making maps for your worlds or for your people not even necessarily for publication but just for your own research i highly recommend giving auto realm a try there is an even steeper learning curve than there is to gimp i feel like so that takes a little bit of getting used to but I've linked below to some great tutorial videos that helped me get used to everything. It's not perfect, it does run a little slow, and putting text on it is harder, so I prefer to put all of the terrain and the roads and stuff on in Auto Realm, and then put all of the words on in Photoshop. But yeah, overall, I'm so impressed and I'm having so much fun with it, and so I knew I just had to tell you guys about it. I've also included the link below to where you can safely download it. I've downloaded it myself. It's completely safe. My computer is still working, no viruses. It's legit. So yeah, let me know in the comments if you end up using it and if you like it and what your methods are, if you like to combine or do all of your map making in Auto Realm or all of it in GIMP. And I will see you on Sunday for our usual Word Nerds live chat. Stay nerdy.